What's up guys, Burning Heavy here on a pub. This is Fast Lane. Once again, I am playing Scout, but that is not important. What is important is the vlog, and today I want to talk about something that is close to my heart. Nintendo. It is close to my heart because up until the late 90s, Nintendo was how I gamed. First was my dad's Super Nintendo. Then I got it for Christmas, I think, when I was 10 and N64, and it was awesome. I played games like Super Mario World, Mario 64, Mario Kart, Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, still haven't beaten that, and other amazing games like that. Nintendo has made some amazing games, but that is where they've begun to struggle. They've obsessed over three things that are really, really hurting them. Beating a dead horse, going too casual, and obsessing over gimmicky accessories. Going with the gimmicky accessories. The motion controls for the Wii work with some of the casual games, but the Wii mode's terrible. People use the GameCube controller, which wasn't that great of a controller. The last good controller was the N64. But I digress. The Wii U thingy abomination is terrible. It limits you to four hours of gaming. You can't play it while it's charging. There's that big ass screen that just gets in the way. It's bad. Okay. But they want to shove it down your throat. It's kind of like Xbox wants to shove the Kinect down your throat. That, that's a problem. When you're obsessing over these gimmicks instead of making quality products, it's going to hurt your bottom line. And that's what's happening to Nintendo. Another thing that's happening to Nintendo is they're beating a dead horse. Mario, Zelda, Metroid, Smash Bros. That, that's all they got anymore. You know, even Donkey Kong's getting to the point where they're beating a dead horse. That's all they'll make. That's all they'll release. And they release that and games like Wii Fit. Who's gonna buy a system that doesn't have the games for it? You know? Why would I buy a Wii to play Mario? Screw that, I'll live without playing Mario. You know, people aren't as obsessed over their games anymore. You know? And the one thing they do have going for them is Pokemon, which people buy the latest handheld just to keep up with the Pokemon. So, what I have to say is, make a new original product. You know, what, what's their last character they've made that's original? Okay, or even bring back something you haven't done for a while. I don't know, make a new Star Fox or something. Those are all things that you could do that I just don't know if they're going to. Which is a problem. And, you know, the third thing they're doing is... They're making it so that third parties aren't wanting to come to them because no one wants the product. Uh, they, they got Bayonetta 2 to come to the Wii U, and that's got nothing but complaints because the people who play Bayonetta don't own a Wii U. So no one is going to buy Bayonetta 2 because no one owns a Wii U. So you're going to have this great game, kind of like uh, Donkey Kong, the Frozen tropical paradise thingy, the new Donkey Kong game. It's supposed to be excellent. It's supposed to be amazing. No one's playing it. No one owns a Wii U. Nintendo is now trying to do this new thing. It's like a health initiative to help people get fit and active. Is that what they're going to do to replace the Wii U? Just be like, you know what? We're done making games. We're just going to try to make people healthy. Is, is that what they're going for? If it is, I don't know if it's smart. I, I, don't, I don't know if that's the direction Nintendo needs to go. I think Nintendo just needs to make some new IP, uh, retire some of their older IP. That might not be popular, but uh, I think we can live with only 50,000 Mario games. Um, you know, retire it instead of beating the crap out of a dead horse like I've been doing to this friendly pyro. But I think they need to do that and come up with original IP. And they need to figure out what their market is. Do they want to abandon the hardcore marketplace? I think that's okay. You know, Sony, Microsoft, they're fighting over the hardcore marketplace, saying, you know what, guys, go ahead. We got the casual stuff. But we made a ton of money on casual stuff. 
The DS is almost entirely full of casual stuff. I think that's okay. I think that's something that they can do, but that's a decision they need to make. They need to see what their priorities are. They need to see, okay, what are we doing right, what are we doing wrong, and they need to focus on that. Or else we're not going to have Nintendo for much longer because they, they just can't compete. But uh, this has been Burning Heavy, and as always, leave a like, leave a favorite, leave a subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you want me to talk about next, what you want me to make as a video next. I am brainstorming some ideas on what I could do to, you know, widen the channel up a bit, do some new stuff. Should be exciting. But as always, have a wonderful day.